guys, welcome back to the Harmon Boys. I'm um, obviously with the other Harmon Boys. And, it's, and today, um, today, I guess we're just going to be doing a uh, survival string video. Yeah, uh, this is how you make a string. That This stuff is from our last crayfish trap. Uh, trap we did. You know, recycled, recycled stuff. So I guess he's just going to jump and explain as he goes along. So you want to cut off the top of the bottle, and you want to make it, mm -hmm. depends what you're using it for. I like it about quarter an inch. And then you just want to, just, you want to kind of clean it off, and then, if. That face you're making, though. Yeah. I'm focused. Then you just want to keep going, and. Turning the bottle. Make it as thick as you want. I like thicker rope. Or cordage. Sorry guys, my finger was sort of in way. <laughs> oh, my hand's cramping. You can also do this a knife, you stab it in the wood so, and just pull. I guess I'm gonna get a little close up. What he's doing is just Cutting little strips. Obviously, this is stuff. You can use that um, too, but yeah, but this it's is not going to give a lot. Uh, what you probably do is cut off this uh, right here. You could probably make a little bit. Cut that off, and see, this is just stuff like I told recycling. Remember, recycle. Who we use a bottle for our crayfish? We'll probably go camping. Go soon. and check that out. Yeah, and then we'll probably, I'll top probably take this, and you can also use a knife to do it. Like I have this good knife right on my hand. Do you want to use that? No. We'll, we'll probably use that to cut all stuff up. Probably doing fishing videos and all that. Oh, we're we're about that survival. Here, do you want to switch? Makes a pretty good, decent all thing. Right, I'm going to start cut, cutting a little bit of that. There's Those holes, holes so. from our crayfish video. It's pretty and strong. You can use scissors for this. You, you know. can stab a knife in this wood and just pull. Yeah. Pretty good cordage. You gotta be careful though, because you will cut yourself on this. Yes. But see this. It's pretty thick. If you have two bottles for the crayfish, you know what I mean. Hold that end. And it this is pretty good, decent. You can probably make it a little longer, so depends what size bottle you have. If you do this, and if, you, if you make it thinner too, you can make it longer. But I you can you can use this as a um five gallon jug. What? A jug. Yeah, you can make it out of a jug. Um, this is how long this is right now. Uh, you know. It's actually pretty. Look, this is sharp, so watch out for that. Maybe for if you want, if you don't want these sharp ends, grab your scissors or knife or whatever, or whatever you're using, and cut off some of it. And then you come over like this is the little posts. You can easily. I mean, it's a little difficult to tie that. You can make it really thin and try to make the fishing line. So like this. And I'm I'm terrible. This. He's terrible at tying it's, knots. It's a little, it's a little um, hard to tie, but it's a good camping survival thing if you don't have a string. If you're and in a hurry. Tie like that. That. And take it back around. Tie it about one more. Move your thumb. Pretty strong. And the durability. It's actually pretty... Pretty durable. I'm pulling actually. Look at the post shaking. Okay. That ripped there because it's pretty thin, but. Yeah, the reason because I don't know. I cut it retarded. Yeah, because this was a little cut. Right so. here, just. Yeah, right here. <laughs> Pull that. It's actually moving the post. Yeah. That's pretty strong. So I'm probably gonna have to cut this off or untie it easy. So, you know, this is actually a pretty. Nice. I'm gonna let him take over for a little. Yeah, you can do this for whatever. See you in the next video. Bye.